less than 30 seconds away from physical separation. Undocking confirmed. GSO 1 2 confirmed. OVK command issue. RO OK OVK 1 8. Yes. Yes, you got the regime. Indicator mode confirm. Okay, press confirm those one one. Everything looking good in the initial separation of the Soyuz TMA twenty. No FOD visible at the docking interface. Kondratiev, Coleman and Nespoli bidding farewell to the International Space Station after one hundred fifty seven days on board. Selection to BEM A nine. Undocking occurring at four thirty five PM Central Time. As the International Space Station and Endeavour pass 220 miles over eastern China. Moscow, Varag 1. Observing separation. One minute, 20 seconds. Have a look. Copy that, Zima. Activate program 3. Paolo, please issue J5 to activate program 3. Inward. J5 has been issued. Program 3 has been activated. Inaudible. Yes, I can confirm. About 40 seconds away from the first of two separation burns. Two minutes have elapsed. Separation is stable. I observing the docking assembly. Copy. Visual range one five time two thirty. Fifteen seconds to separation burn. Ten seconds. Yes, the yes. is in operation. Back out burn is in progress. The first of two separation burns underway. Kondratiev at the controls. Five days after the arrival of the space shuttle Endeavour, the Soyuz TMA-20 departs, heading for a landing in south central Kazakhstan. Five seconds to shut down. Yes. There's your unprecedented portrait, at least from station cameras, the Space Shuttle Endeavour and the final days of its final mission and the Soyuz TMA-20 against the limb of the Earth. Varagi, Moscow, you can turn off the light. Command S-18. Copy. Maneuver in progress. Continuing back out. Inaudible. Hello, Igor. 
We should be arriving at the station keeping point about two minutes from now, at which point uh, Kondratiev will uh, put the brakes on basically and begin a period of station keeping at a distance of about 180 meters, enabling Paolo Nespoli to unstrap from his seat on the left side of the uh, descent module and open the hatch back up to the habitation module to make his way in with a digital camera and a high definition camera for the start of imagery acquisition. ATV is in the line of sight. Copy. Visual range 115. This view from the uh, external camera on the Soyuz TMA-20. Now 155 meters away from the Rosviet module, continuing a separation rate. Do you need to see this one? Do you want? Second. A big one. Do you need to see the big one? I know you yes, yes, both. Okay. Thank you. Appreciate it. Space Shuttle Endeavour in view on the lower right side of your picture. Again, this is the engineering overlay view that uh, Russian flight controllers use for data as the Soyuz separates from the International Space Station. Once uh, the Soyuz vehicle reaches its station-keeping position, the International Space Station will return to its original undocking attitude. Paolo Nespoli is expected to begin his photography activities and his imagery acquisition with a high-definition camera about eight and a half minutes from now. Okay, SM as reference, one cell and a quarter. At, the, at that point, we are going to start braking. And curb. Standing by for Kondratiev to initiate uh, impulses uh, in his uh, hand controller that will initiate the braking for station keeping. Continuing separation. Okay. What is the approximate range? We have slowed down. Uh, the range is about 170. Copy. 170 meters separating Soyuz from the International Space Station. Again, this view from the Soyuz camera, the external uh, black and white engineering camera, but this approximates the same view that Paolo Nespoli will be getting when he makes his way into the upper portion of the Soyuz, the habitation module. Start breaking. Let's wait a little more. Let's wait until we reach 200. Okay, copy. One hundred eighty meters uh, separating uh, Soyuz from the station, braking underway, station keeping about to begin. Okay, copy. Range is one eight zero. Ready for the roll. 